C H A R O D S. Welcome. You're so polite, Mr. Dog. <laughs> Welcome to the Treetop Toy Shop. I'm Charles. What's your name? Oh, that's a doggone good name. <laughs> Speaking of dogs, today I'm going to show you how to draw your very own dog using three letters and three simple shapes. We have an S, an M, a U, an oval, a triangle, and a rectangle. Let's dive in. The first thing we're gonna do is pick a color that we wanna use. There's no right color, just one that touches your heart, makes you feel good. I'm gonna start with black. Ooh, where are you going, Jumbo Crons? You're gonna crush something. Be careful. Put you guys right back there. I'll get you later. All right, let's start in the middle of our sheet. Remember, this doesn't have to be perfect. In fact, the imperfections are what make it special. The first thing I'm gonna do is draw an oval in the center of my page, like that. That's not bad. Then we're gonna draw an upside down triangle, like that. That's gonna be his nose. The next thing we're gonna do is use our letter U. We're gonna draw one U here, one U here, and now I'm gonna draw my last U using red. Where are you guys running off to? Come back, we got work to do. <laughs> the last U is gonna be right in the center, and that's gonna be our dog's tongue. <laughs> Okay, now we have his little mouth. The next thing I want you to do is draw another U right on top of his head, but it's gonna be upside down like this. And if it's easier, you can turn your page around. I'll show you. Be careful, Barb, don't get dizzy. Look at this. We're gonna draw another U like this. At the top of his head. Turn you back around. The next shape I'm gonna use is another oval. These are gonna be his eyes. We're gonna have one oval and two ovals. Look at that. And if you want to, you can draw a smaller oval right in the center. Those will be his pupils. I'm gonna give him pretty blue eyes. Let's draw another oval like that. And one more. Oh, that's perfect. He can see us now. All right, what else do we need? Oh, puppy dogs have ears. Let's give him some ears. Put my blue down and I'll get my black back out. I think we'll use a rectangle for our ears. Let's see. Let's put one right here. Oh, that's great. Let's do another one right here. Here, yes, I love it. But he needs that little flap that goes down. Makes him look so cute. So let's use a triangle. We'll put a triangle right here and a triangle right here. He's looking good. He can hear us now. Hey, Mr. Puppy Dog, we love drawing you. <laughs> okay, now he needs a little bit of a body. We're gonna use the letter M to draw our dog's body. So just take your crayon like so, or you can use a pencil, a pen, a marker, some leaves. <laughs> Don't use leaves, doesn't make sense. Okay, so I'm gonna start down here. I like to draw just a big letter. Look at this, that's a big M. Oh, that's lovely, that's his body. Oh, and this right here is gonna be like a little bandana that he wears. I'm gonna go ahead and fill that in with my red crayon. Red, you can use whatever color you like. There's no right answer. It's just whatever makes you feel good about yourself and about your picture. I'm gonna use red, look at this. 
I'm just gonna fill him in. Oh, you can stay between the lines, or you don't have to. Sometimes you can get reckless and scribble right out on the edge. You rebels. <laughs> okay, let's give him some paws so we can sit. I'm gonna use my black and two triangles to give our puppy dog some paws. <laughs> so we're gonna go, let's bring this down. We're gonna go one triangle and two triangles. Now he has some little paws. He can pat around on his paws. <laughs> That's great. Ooh, what else do we need? Ooh, every good puppy dog has a tail. They love to wag their tails when they get excited. I'm gonna use the letter S to draw my tail. Start right here and just go S. Ooh, that's good. And you can use another S to give that tail some thickness. So let's just go right inside and we're just gonna draw another S. Look at that. You can cap it off right there. Complete it. That's great. He looks wonderful. I'm gonna color him in a little bit more. I think I'll do black for his nose. Oh, that's wonderful. Maybe I'll give him some black paws as well. That's great. Hmm. Let's get our brown out. I like a black and a brown dog. What? Come back, Red! You're always running off, Red. <laughs> Let's color our face in. Doesn't have to be perfect. Look at this. This is great. Color of the ears. <laughs> You're looking great, puppy dog. Ooh, let's do his tail. Yes, look at this. And then maybe you want to just color in his body. Like this. Look at this guy, he's so cute. Don't run off now. We love you too much, you're our best friend. Look at this. There we have a puppy dog. <gasps> Don't eat him, Barb. <laughs> Oh, it's dinner time! Hey, do you want to come to dinner with us, puppy dog? We're not having dog food, but I'm sure you like chicken soup. <laughs> the sun is setting. Now it's time to go. Before we leave, I want you to know that in this treetop, you'll always have a friend. So if you're feeling sad, Come play again! Guess what, Bill? We got a dog! C-H-A-R-O-E-S <laughs>